Kick it off with the rules. If I look at you <laughs> and you don't want to be roasted, look away. You are in control of your own destiny. You are the master of your fate. You are the captain of your soul. If you lock eyes with me tonight, what happens to you ain't on me no more. And don't be acting all sensitive for other people. Fuck them. They paid for this. <laughs> Fuck them. They paid for this. Shit. Set your ass down here. Don't try to look all serious. You paid for this. Lucy Lou, I'll cook your ass with smithereens. Goddamn turtleneck in 2024. Let's get to the shit, man. Why you got your hat so low, man? You don't like your eyebrows? <laughs> Dressed like Montel Jordan. This is how he did it. <laughs> I'm gonna work my way around this bitch and have me some fun. What's your name, though, uh, eyebrows? Ryan. Huh? Ryan. Nice to meet you, man. And who you with? This your, this your, uh, this, this your boy? Coworkers? This, this just two, two guy friends out on a night. Huh? This was on sale for a little while. You had time to find your young lady to bring if you wanted to, and you, you brought your homeboy. You're like, hey man, let's just let's go down here and put our thighs together. And... <laughs> Are you a nervous eater? You was fucking them nachos up. <laughs> it's not often that I roast somebody and they eat three or four bites at the same time. He was like, oh. <laughs> Where y'all work at? I work for Garter World Security. You work for what? Garter World Security. What do you say? Argo World? I heard the security part, but I need to know where. Okay. Garter World. Okay, sir. Finish your food. <laughs> <laughs> where you work at? <laughs> man, put the fork down, man. I'm talking to y'all. God damn, you're gonna be on the internet eating like a motherfucker. You think I'm gonna edit that out? I'm gonna let you chew too. And the microphone right in your face. This is gonna hear every chew. I'm out here with my boyfriend eating. You said Argo World? Is that what you said? Gargo World. Gargo World? Nah, that's gay. Fuck that. I'm not gonna look into that no more. <laughs> He work at the Gargle store? Bro, that's crazy. He's security too. Get that dick out your mouth. Uh, I came here to Gargle. Blah, 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 blah. Give me some out there. No, but you didn't pay the Gargle, the Gargle fee to get in. <laughs> Is it extra for balls? <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. I don't know if that's gonna make it onto the thing, but we had us a moment. You crying? What's wrong? You having you a good time, huh? Who you with? This is a. Uh, no, this is, this is the free guy. Who's that? Okay, pop a bottle then. <laughs> she like fuck this tape and I'm gonna get this money. <laughs> Shit, it's got all these cameras. Pop, nigga, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Gotta be a hundred dollars. All right. Mm-hmm. Turn up. So I wanted to talk to you. So the guy in the free hug shirt is who to you? That's your husband? That's what's up. So this is a double date? Is this a husband and wife as well? They sat us at this table because we were at a... So no. That was an awfully wordy answer. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Are you guys a couple though? Okay. And so how long y'all been married? 
Okay. I'm going to come over here for a little while. I'm going to let you get all your synapses firing and shit. And then I'm going to come back. Because these long pauses and these bullshit ass answers. No. You do got some nice titties, but your answers are trash. Okay? Yeah, look. Other women are clapping. I saw them. Them titties crazy, huh? Huh? If I had those, I'd have them out. Shit. <laughs> but I don't. So I got a raspberry beret. <laughs> All right, let's move around. All right, you cut your own hair with a pocket knife? Ah, right, damn. What kind of hairdo is that? Is the back gone too? Put your head down. God damn. Did you cut his hair? Fiance. Your fiance. Is she uh, sighted? So she not blind? <laughs> she don't want to taper that in or nothing. I just... Hit you with the Pepe Le Pew and send you out to the front row. Is it always like that? She bought the tickets and sent you out like that. Yeah, this is a setup. That's crazy. <laughs> you left a little strip like it's a vagina on the back of your head. <laughs> you looked at me like, how did he come up with that? I don't know. I'll just come up with it. This crowd is wildly diverse, like, for real. I don't know why all the black people in the back, but... <laughs> okay, you two, but look at the rest of the people. This shit down here look like a cornhole tournament. <laughs> all the black people in the back. At my club, we supposed to be mixing it up better than that. It's supposed to be a little salt, a little pepper, a little tahine, I know they in here. <laughs> it's young, old, short, tall, dress, not dressed. People just in here. All right, let me come back over here. You ready, Titties, for some questions? I want to make sure you're good. <laughs> What's your name? Because calling you Titties is wildly inappropriate. Gina. Hi, Gina. Damn, Gina. <laughs> What's your name, sir? Martin? <laughs> Look at the back of the room laugh. <laughs> White people are like, why would he be Martin? <laughs> Luther King Jr.? I'm confused. Does he have a dream? <laughs> Has he been to the mountaintop? I don't understand why he would be Martin. So Gina, and what'd you say your name was? Huh? He has a speech impediment. He has a speech impediment? Who sat y'all right there like this? <laughs> she said he has a speech impediment. Like, her words been coming out regular. <laughs> God damn, I would hate to hear y'all talk on the phone. <laughs> Shit. She don't answer nothing you ask her. He can't answer at all. <laughs> you want to go to the movies? Turtle shells, titty fuck. Yes, no, yes. <laughs> what? <laughs> Jesus Christ. For those of you that don't know what's going on, I'm just making this shit up. That's how this is gonna work. You're gonna get an hour of just made up shit. Let's move on. So uh, who is, is this, is this table all connected in some kind of way? Yeah? How do y'all know the church lady? <laughs> what's your name, Mildred? Agnes? It's two names, huh? It's like Beth Ann, Glenda Sue. <laughs> What's your name? You about it's, it's, uh, <laughs> Meryl. Meryl. <laughs> I knew it was gonna be an old ass name, Meryl. <laughs> you got on your little, uh, you got on a tight ass outfit, Meryl, for your age group right there. Hey, hey, stand up, let him look at you. Take your, take your jacket off. Stand up, let him see you, Meryl. She grabbed her titties. Oh, don't shake them like that. That's crazy. Then the titties off of uh, something about Mary when he was looking and it was the wrong titties. <laughs> Damn, you dress like Katniss Everdeen. <laughs> what district? 
district did you buy your outfit in? <laughs> you look like the captain of a bobsled team. <laughs> Coach, my helmet does not fit. <laughs> you good, Sonka. <laughs> Sorry to whoever's wearing headphones. <laughs> so it's Meryl. That's what they call you. Everybody in life call you Meryl. You got a nickname or some shit. You got too much pizzazz for that name. You won't tell the nickname. Oh shit. What's it, Sweet Cheats or something crazy like that? Don't tell him my nickname. I don't do that. His throat goat, 5,000. <laughs> <laughs> you single? I'm gonna hook you up with somebody. You gonna go home tonight with you a nice young man. Hell yeah. You single, Meryl? Okay, we're gonna get you right. Okay, anybody like, uh, history films? <laughs> she went to school with Rosa Parks, man. If you wanna be a part of the movement, I just want you to know, she was in Montgomery at the first boycott, not the folding chair, before the buses. You gotta know your history if you're gonna get with her. Young man, young man, young man. <laughs> what year is your car outside? <laughs> the 77 Oldsmobile. <laughs> whoa, 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 fire. Where are you going? I'm going to Bobby House. B-O-B-Y. <laughs> Two B's. Sound the same. <laughs> Had a little call back. All right, so what do you do for a living? Meryl. Mm -hmm. Let's talk. Huh? Which job? Okay, I wanted you to be retired, but goddamn. Which job you gonna die on? Goddamn, Meryl, you're 332 years old. When you gonna lay it down? Fuck y'all, don't grumble and groan. That's your mama's mama. <laughs> you was born in 63. 65. 55? 61. You were born in 1961. God damn. That's before condoms. <laughs> she went to Woodstock. <laughs> so who are the other people at the table? How do you know these three white children? Did you adopt them? Because this is the most odd little group. Huh? That's your grandma? Okay, well, shout out to adoption. <laughs> that ain't your grandma, Bronnie man. <laughs> How you know them, Meryl? How you know these white folks? I work with her. You work with her? You really do work still. That's crazy, I was joking. Where do you work at? I'm at a community college. You work at a community college? Yeah, I'm a community college. I'm an academic advisor. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Take your ass to class. Get good grades. You don't want to be working when you're my age. <laughs> I'm already dead. <laughs> I remember when they started doing math around here. It was just English. We added math. Meryl. Mm -hmm. And what's your name, uh, co-worker? Adrian, like from the Rocky joint? <laughs> okay. <laughs> they all said, Adrian! <laughs> Too easy. And what about the brownie man? What's your real name, bro? Uh, Gary. Nice to meet you, Gary. Why'd you pause before you said your own name? <laughs> uh, it's the pressure, right? Like all the cameras and shit. You're like, uh, 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 Gary? <laughs> and who's this with the Princess Leia hair? Nicola? Okay. Like the Hooper? Like Jokic? Are you from here? Uh, right now? That's what a spy would say. I know a goddamn spy when I see one. Nicola. Nice to meet you. Y'all all work at TCC or just them two in the front? Okay, what do y'all do for a living in the back? Uh -oh. <laughs> Meryl said, uh-oh. 
pee on your ass. <laughs> This is how Richard Pryor used to be. I was there when he back when Richard first started off. We used to call him Dick Pryor, but then he said, call him by his full name. I was there, I seen Richard Pryor when he first took a microphone. I said, Richard, stop doing all that freebies. He told me, shut up, shut your ass up, Meryl. I, I'm minding my business, you know. I told him, hey, one day I'm gonna be an academic advisor. People gonna listen to my advice. <laughs> Look at Titty's trying to bond. Here's a Titty. Fountain of youth, give me that titty. <laughs> so what do you do, Nicola? Uh, stay at home, mom. You stay at home, mom. Okay, so uh, sir, how good is your job? I'm in the army. You're in the army? Oh man, thank you for your service. <laughs> you in the army too? Okay, thank you for your service as well. Right. Is it only two of y'all? One exit north of the whole base, there's only two soldiers in this bitch. Huh? That's crazy. What about you, eyebrows? You a soldier or something? Nope. You look like you're coming out of water. <laughs> Got them scuba hats you got on. All right, so you in the military over here? Okay, what's your name, boss? Brian. Brian? Nice to meet you. And uh, you from Texas or somewhere in the South? You keep touching your hat rim. Nah, bro, I just, I was raised right. <laughs> you were just raised right? Okay, let's discuss that and see how. <laughs> let's see how well you was raised. <laughs> you from here? Nah, I'm from Cali. You from Cali, what part? San Francisco. What part? <laughs> okay, so you from the hood? Okay, there's two parts to San Francisco. They got a part you can't even drop your keys in. <laughs> no, I dropped my, oh, 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 oh. Get off of me, sir. You from the other part. How much for uh, a nickel back? <laughs> a nickel, oh, okay. So this your woman here, your wife? Ain't you the one that had on the shirt that said that you look better uh, on all fours or some shit? What it say? I look better bent over. You look better bent over. <laughs> he said it's true. She do look better. Yeah, yeah. Remind me of San Francisco. <laughs> All right. So y'all a couple? Y'all hanging on to each other now? Yeah. How long y'all been together? Look, she nervous as shit. Okay, the rule is if, you, if I look at you and you look away, I leave you alone. So I'm gonna move around because your ass start looking at everything but me. <laughs> no, you were like, shit, oh my God. <laughs> Go back over there and talk about the slaves some more. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's you, Meryl. <laughs> yeah, that's a slave joke, Meryl. She's not a slave, sir. She was born way too late to be a slave. I saw you get a little excited. You're like, <laughs> you telling me there's free labor in here? <laughs> First thing I want you to do is cut my son's hair. The rest of it off. This is some bullshit. <laughs> You're like a human weasel. Your hair is trash. And what do you do, sir? You look like you do a very serious occupation or something. Your face, you got rest in fuck y'all face. Yeah, what do you do, man? Uh, retired firefighter. You're a retired firefighter? Well, thank you for your service, man. We need you too. Yeah. Ain't no joke coming behind that. We need the firefighters. Shit, I prefer them over the police, personally. Yeah. Somebody choking, call all the firefighters. The police show up. Pop, pop. He ain't breathing no more. I'm like, nigga, he was choking. Well, he did now. I remember when the police did the shoot when they pulled up. They used to just come up and talk to you. Now they start shooting everybody. I don't remember. I remember when the police would have a decent conversation. Leave Meryl alone. Leave Meryl alone? I'm on Meryl's shiny ass. <laughs> Meryl don't give a fuck. This is what I said at the beginning. Don't be sensitive for other people. She paid for this. Meryl, shake your titty at her. Show her it's real. 
Yeah. So mind your business. And the next time you take your bonnet off, comb your hair out. <laughs> Y'all got the same barber. Your shit is bullshit too. <laughs> you really do look a little bit insane. Like, I, I'm worried about you. Security, keep an eye on this dude with this hairdo. Khadijah, you see him with the hair? Him, right here? Watch him. You look like you go too far with pets. Like, you just... Like, you'll fuck a cat up. Like, meow! Oh, come here. <laughs> <laughs> Don't even look at that hair guy. He's not normal. This your son? God damn. Okay. So what have you been doing since you've been retired? Cutting hair. You're not retired? I like that. I'll accept that answer. Titty said, he's been cutting hair. I'll accept that. So you're not retired? I work for the uh, Washington State Patrol. You work for the Washington State Patrol? So why you didn't say that when I said, no, oh, shut your bitch ass up. I asked you what you do. You the goddamn police. Everybody say fuck the police on three. One, two, three. For the times that they come when we don't call them. When we need them, they, yay, police. When we don't need them and they show up, defund these niggas. God damn, why they keep fucking with me? <laughs> He's not a cop. But his check says Washington State. That's a cop, man. That's a cop, okay? He gets you out of trouble. Don't judge him by his hair. He's a good kid. <laughs> He's fucking a cat. <laughs> Is it a black cat? <laughs> that fucked Meryl up. Look, look, look. All right, I'm just gonna talk to everybody who faces too serious for the moment. This is just joyful, fun romp through comedy, and some of y'all face look like you're a goddamn pirate that hasn't seen land in nine months. You're supposed to bend dots. So you in the pink, sir, that ain't been laughing that much, looking like a mafia boss. How you doing, man? I'm doing well. Outstanding. I like that you enunciate. I got some people over here that should be wearing helmets. I've been, I've been wanting somebody that could just answer out loud. All the brain, all her blood going to her titties, she can't even think. You have a PhD. So does he. Pretty hard dick. <laughs> I'm sorry, you deserve, that was too easy. You deserve better from me than that. I apologize, that's fucked up. Real quick though, what is your PhD in? You're a doctor? Doctor titties? Huh? You don't help anybody? What kind of doctor are you? Sociology, computer science, but I've also been to prison, so I'm a multi-talented person. Wait, wait. <laughs> Why are you clapping? Did you hear her crazy ass answer? Sociology, <laughs> but I've also been to prison, so. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Did you hear the second half? But I've also been to prison, so. If you've been to prison, that's fine, but I didn't ask you that shit. That's the part I'm trying to make. Why are you volunteering your goddamn record? <laughs> I got some homies as ex-convicts. I don't be judging. Shit. I don't need to drink more. I'm gonna be thinking like you. Now, sir, the mafia boss, what's your name? David. David, nice to meet you, man. And this is your queen you're with? This is my boo. Your boo? Okay, you've been hanging around with the blacks. <laughs> What'd you say? I am black. Well, yeah. hold on. Excuse me, sir. You work for the police. What is he? <laughs> Look over there and profile him. Stop what you're doing and frisk this nigga. Is he black or white? Look at him. He's drinking a, a red Budweiser straight out the bottle. We got Hennessy here. He opted out of that. Nice collared shirt, Salmon. Yeah, golfs every other Saturday. What's your handicap? You golf? What do you do for fun? Uh, bang this one. 
He black. That's some nigga shit. Nobody's saying that. White people don't talk like that. What do you do for fun? Oh, I'll be fucking the shit out this bitch. Like, that's what? She was like, he does. <laughs> She's like, he really does that. He does his best three minutes at a time. <laughs> right on, huh? She's like, he, does, he goes hard when he goes, but once he's done, he's done. <laughs> Meryl like, he needs some goat milk. That's what he needs. That's what we used to drink back when I was young. Goat milk and honey. That's a honey pack. That's right. <laughs> All right, so what do you do for a living? Uh, I'm a caregiver for my mom. Oh, man, you got a big heart, man. I was going to... Yeah. Is she cool? Your mama's sweet? You love her? Good. Sometimes you be having to care for people that be like, get your ugly ass out of here. You be like, I'm here to change your diaper. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> clean them. Fresh diaper. They clean it again. <laughs> All right. So who you with? You know them? These your, these your offsprings here? No, it's Oh, okay. So uh, is this, what, what are you, are you Samoan or something? Yeah. Okay. You know, Fe Umu, Fe Amo. Chew. This your wife right here with you? That's your girlfriend? How long y'all been dating? Uh, a few months. A few months? Oh, okay, just getting started. How you meet your queen? Uh, through uh, Hinge. Mm. What's that? What's Hinge? Who, who said that? The doctor that doesn't know shit? Jesus <laughs> Christ. What's a Hinge? <laughs> it's a dating app. It's also what makes doors swing open. <laughs> All right. Let me talk to these hippies right here. How y'all doing? <laughs> Yeah, that's a hippie outfit you got on. You see, you, she's like, oh, I smoke. Hell yeah. <laughs> it just looked like patchouli oil over here. It looked like an offbeat dancer in front of a tent. Like, yeah. Dirty feet. <laughs> you guys are a couple. I met you before, right? Yeah, I met him. Because I thought he was a scientist or something. We ain't never seen each other before? Yeah, you got a doppelganger, bro. There's a serial killer out here look just like you. What do you say? You're bulimic? Oh, okay, bulimic. I was like, oh my God, what, what is going on? Look what you started. Everybody's saying random shit. I'm bulimic. <laughs> I believed you too, because I can see all your neck muscles, so I didn't know, I didn't know what was going on. So this is a couple, and then who's this? Just third wheel in it? Since junior high? Well, thank you for bringing them out. I appreciate you. So uh, you guys were friends in junior high? That's amazing. You got, how do you not fall out? Women be beefing after like two months. Right? She was here last month with a girl, her homegirl. She left her to bring out him right here, Nostradamus. So you two been friends since middle school? How did y'all meet? Just like at recess? You were in the choir? Two old white ladies. What was y'all singing back then? 555,000. 600 minutes. Black people, that's from the, uh, the Broadway play Rent. <laughs> Two black people threw up. Oh, I hate Rent. Meryl, rent is when you gotta pay for your place one month at a time. <laughs> I know everything in your life is paid off. That goddamn old, you've been living for free for 38 years. <laughs> and what do you do for a living, Beret? I'm a comedian. You a comedian? Okay. Damn, somebody else said they were as well. You're not now? What do you do for money? I am an office manager for a commercial roofing company. Y'all need to turn the AC down. I just got hit with a drip. You're a commercial what now? 
I, I'm an office manager for a commercial roofing company. You're an office manager for a commercial roofing company. So whatever drip you're feeling, I can get my guys up there to fix it. Do they all wear berets? <laughs> if you want us to. <laughs> okay, and who is your friend right here with the, with the beautiful this dimples? This is my best friend since uh, middle school, too. Okay, she like, fuck y'all. <laughs> How did y'all meet? Just uh, playing tetherball? Huh? Elementary school, we was the tetherballs. Okay, but how did y'all meet in middle school? In middle school, we were You don't even know, huh? You're like, I was a hall monitor, she kept in. <laughs> <laughs> we stayed up the street and down the street from each other. That's right. Okay, and so where y'all husbands? Y'all got on some big ass rings. He's at home. Okay. Where they should be. Uh -huh. <laughs> Damn, Titty said that's where they should be. <laughs> Your husband mad as a motherfucker. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> beep, 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 bitch! I can leave the house if I want. Thank you very much for everybody you blessed this month, man. We've been praying real hard, trying to get some blessings to come down. Appreciate you very much. Thank you, White Jesus, for coming on out. <laughs> it's either that or a serial killer. I'm not sure which one. What do you do? What's your name? Nice to meet John, like the disciple. What do you do for a living? Uh, I'm a pit master at a barbecue restaurant. You're a pit master at a barbecue restaurant? In this state? Fuck y'all making raccoons? <laughs> this ain't no barbecue area. Damn. What's the place called? It's called The Smoking Up. The Smoking. Oh, yeah, he's like, get it together, Teddy. Look, not that. It's The Smoking Oak. Oh, okay. So y'all use post oak to cook y'all meat? Uh, we can't get post oak because that's like a Texas thing, but we get white oak. <laughs> oh, I know where it's a thing. I know what I'm talking about. You use white oak? That's how I know it don't taste good. Goddamn meat ain't got no seasoning on it. They cook everything. They're using white oak. You can't find no black locusts. Where's this place at, man, in case I want to come get some barbecue? It's, it's uh, Vancouver, Washington. That don't mean I won't go. Fuck you. <laughs> you said it like it was out of reach. Oh, it's, it's <laughs> Vancouver, Washington. <laughs> you got too much hair to be cooking barbecue and shit, man. You got, you're supposed to be bald-headed, man. Your hair is in all that goddamn food. <laughs> but it's blessed, right? Jesus touched it. So is that where y'all from? Y'all from the coop? No, I'm from Portland. You from Portland? That's the same shit, sir. It's eight minutes away, sir. Same shit. Same shit. Portland's where all the black people look like that. We can't figure out what they are. <laughs> Keep it weird. That's what y'all say. You got butt naked white people riding bikes. That's Portland. <laughs> you do. You got butt naked people riding bikes. They be in the back trying to keep up. Wait a minute. But the uncircumcised, they get caught in the chain. Oh, 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 that's it, that's it, I'm going home. <laughs> so all five of y'all from uh, Portland, from down there? You from Kirkland? So you don't know them, you just, that's where y'all got sat? No, we all family. You're family. Well, y'all from the, just whole, as far as you can get away from here, really. Okay, so this is your cousin, sister? No, if you put it this way, these all three right here are my brothers. The little one or Jesus? <laughs> this is my older brother. The little one is the oldest? Yeah. Oh, damn. They came out and took all the nutrients, didn't they? <laughs> <laughs> he was smooth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm the oldest. What's happening? You know what I'm saying? Talk your shit. What's happening? You want to talk, talk your shit? Talk your shit now, motherfucker. I'm the oldest. What's your name, Smooth? Miguel. Miguel. Oh, so, so y'all not white? No, what are y'all? No, he's white. At least that's the depiction that white people want us to believe. So you three are what? Portuguese? What are y'all? 
Oh, 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 oh. Miguel. Mexican. Mexican and native? That's what's up. That's two different types of native. I respect that. And what about him? He, you. Native American, full blood. Oh, you say full blood like you were better than him. He was like Native American, full blood. He's a fucking muggle. Isn't that right, Hermione? God damn. And what are you? Sir, I'm looking right at your ass. I'm Mexican. You're Mexican. Mexican and native. Got it. So, yeah, real quick though. You, you the baby? You the, you're not, are you related or not? Spiritual He's the baby. Okay, this is crazy. Listen, who is blood relatives? Not just, just that, us two. Got it, so he's just trying to participate. He threw me off, Miguel. I was like, wait. He's blood to be brother, bro. He's his family no matter what. Yeah, yeah but uh, apparently the blood matters, because he was like, full blood. <laughs> Suwu, east side. Like, he went hard. Should night. <laughs> Little Wayne for seven years. <laughs> Chris Brown, when he mad. <laughs> That's when Chris Brown's a blood. Anyway, I didn't see y'all till right now. How y'all doing? Two cuties, two cuties. <laughs> and this is up. So what are you, while we're talking about nationalities, what are you? I am Palawan. Huh? Palawan. Palawan? Meryl, if somebody is Palauan, where are they from? Palau? Palau? Okay, where's Palau? I didn't take geology. She said, I didn't take geology. <laughs> you the one telling the students what classes to take and you don't know the difference between geology and geography? That's your old ass. I didn't take geology. I don't know what the hell a Palau is. That's how you get the snow out the road. That's what I wish one of these young men would do to me. Palau my ass. Okay, so where's Palau? In the South Pacific. You hella pretty. Is everybody pretty from there? You think so? And then what are, what are you? You don't look like you Palau. You Cambodian? Yeah, because your head is perfectly round. <laughs> right? Speaking of bloods. <laughs> huh? Cambodians are bloods. All right. Okay. Come on back to your seat, player. Are you from Palau as well? Where are you from? Harlem. Tacoma, are you from the TAC? Um, what part of the TAC are you from? Right here. Like what high school? Over Park. Oh, okay. Lake, Lakewood. <laughs> <laughs> Old school was like, nigga, that's Lakewood. <laughs> that's crazy. He tried to be from Tacoma real quick. Caught his ass. <laughs> Stopped him at the door of Al Davies. Nigga, you're not from here. <laughs> Take your ass to Lacey with Nate Jackson's fat ass. All right, so you, it's you and this your girl right here from Palau? Yeah. Oh, that's what's up, that's what's up. Congratulations to your love. And then this is your Cambodian friend? Okay. Is this a, a thruple or what's this? Oh, he's still pooping? He took a shit at my show? Did your husband take a shit at my goddamn show? Look at me. Did he take a shit at my goddamn show? What'd he say when he left? He's like, I'm just gonna pee, I'll be right back. Or he's like, I gotta take a shit. Is that him? Are you the husband? Oh, you lucky, you're a lucky, you're a lucky motherfucker. I thought you took a shit at my shop. You almost did. You sat down for a little bit like, no. <laughs> Look at Mrs. Claus. Ho, ho, ho. Who, who's great, great grandma is that? You, that's your mom? You, wait, wait a minute. What, you, you're the oldest white person I've ever seen. How, how, how young are you, ma'am? I'm 74. You're 74? 
Wow. Meryl. <laughs> we about to have a twerk contest. <laughs> 74 versus 73. <laughs> I ain't gonna make you go through that. Meryl dance circles around your ass. <laughs> She's ready for the luge already. Hold on, everybody be quiet, God damn it. We gotta respect our elders, what'd you say? Shut up, everybody. What? My grandchildren bought me a ticket and they dared me to come. And I dared. didn't know what was going on. They bought you a ticket and dared you to come? And you didn't know what was going on? You're about to enter the Thunderdome. <laughs> That's what's about to happen. First of all, your grandkids ain't shit. This is a terrible idea. You guys are fucked up. Graham Graham want to go see a show? She's like, let me get my pearls before we head out. <laughs> Bringing her down here to feed her to a lion? It's crazy. You didn't know you were gonna know people here, huh? Isn't this crazy? You're like, I know my grandbabies. We used to own Meryl. <laughs> hey, Meryl. <laughs> hey, baby. <laughs> Was that too far? Can't take it back, it's in the atmosphere already. <laughs> that did make the sheriff's mouth fall open though. He was like, <laughs> yeah, you're a sheriff now. Freeze! <laughs> so which one is your grand ch huh? Huh? I followed you on YouTube and these guys pretend with my grandchildren. I'm just screwing around. It's the singles table. Wait a minute, so the great great grandma follows me on YouTube. Uh, yeah, but hold on, because this shit is getting weird. <laughs> so then you bought tickets and brought three young people with you, like, just come act like my grandchildren. <laughs> huh? So you're, you're, really, you're a con woman, really. That's what's going on. <laughs> so you didn't even know this old lady. <laughs> really. So if, like, a pit bull ran in here, you'd be like, move, bitch, and, and knock her over. <laughs> or would you hold the dog back, like, run, Graham Brown? <laughs> what's your name? Paula, it's nice to meet you, Paula. Hell yeah. I love your sausage and your, and your, um, <laughs> your pots and pans. <laughs> yeah, it's Paula Dean in this bitch. Where you from, Paula? Uh, squim. Squim? Shit, that's where they hunt the, the whales. <laughs> right, guys? Huh, full blood? Ain't that where you guys hunt the whales? Ngapo. I learned that on Pocahontas. <laughs> Did you just make finger feathers? That's way more racist than anything I've said to him. He was like, I know. What the fuck, sir? No, oh, I can't play like that. Fuck that. You can. Jesus Christ. It was nice to meet you, Paula. I appreciate you. I didn't know y'all had YouTube out there in Squim, so I appreciate you. She what? You said, I'm sexy, Paula? Let me find out, it's Paula Poundstone. <laughs> People trying to see who you are. Stand up, Paula, they want to see what you look like. <laughs> ah, fuck this shit out that old lady. The fuck out <laughs> just, just cause she, Be a bitch, you signed up for that. You signed up for it. That's extra credit curriculum. Welcome to TCC, bitch. <laughs> Tacoma chocolate cock. <laughs> All right, let me come back over here. Uh, no. No, I was like, I was like, what's up with y'all three, man? This is an awkward trio right here. You got a Seahawks fan, a Niners fan sitting together, happy. Wow, that's a gang war. Y'all know each other? Okay, how you know him, man? We work together. Yeah, where y'all work at? Huh? Backpack. Backpack systems. Vet pack. 
Bet. Meryl, what do you say? <laughs> She'd be like, nigga, I don't know what the fuck he said. I do know when sign language was invented, however. I was sitting right there. Yes, I was. My fucker walked up and said like that to me. So I fucked him. After that, he said, I'm on you. I said, that's what that means. So you said backpack, sis? What'd you say? Beck? Yeah. Bet? Bet. Fuck all this. What do y'all do? <laughs> what do you do, uh, Seahawk fan? Uh, I'm, I'm an electrician that works for his company sometimes. Okay. Somebody said, money. <laughs> look, look, the hippie trying to get paid. $200. <laughs> so he works with you, for you? He's a warehouse man. I'm a warehouse man. You the manager. That's dope. And then what's she doing in the middle? Choose between y'all? That's your wife. That's outstanding. How long y'all been together? 14 years. Damn. 14 years. Okay. And so it's just you two and then him? So the whole time y'all been together, he ain't had no bitches? <laughs> Sir, you the manager. You ain't got no females in your life? Look at me. Dad's corrupt. Where's your woman at, sir? I just moved here. Oh, that's a great excuse for being. <laughs> you want to meet a couple other gay men? I can hook y'all up. <laughs> y'all can join the same Facebook group. You have to turn your hat around and lower it down. No, they don't play that. See your eyebrow shit. They don't want to see your expressions. <laughs> he lowered it. <laughs> man, please don't give me no more to drink. Thank you. What's your name? Antoine? I don't know how I find them. <laughs> but you better hide your kids and hide your wife. So, um, so you the boss down there at the warehouse? Okay. And um, do you like each other? Oh, yeah, we talk all the time. Yeah, they're besties. <laughs> they're besties? Your wife is not helping what I'm trying to figure out. They're besties. <laughs> the Call of Duty brothers. Okay, what do you do, ma'am, wifey? What do you do? I'm a district manager. District manager of an anonymous business? Um, of a bakery. <laughs> oh, shit. You got the plug on the cookies? <laughs> Pretzels. <laughs> That's white people snacks. <laughs> it is. You ain't never been to no black person out there like, you want a bowl of pretzels, my guy? <laughs> we don't offer you shit. Sit your ass right there and want things. <laughs> pretzel. What's the name of the pretzel company? Annie Ann. Oh, you don't, you don't, give me a hundred dollars. That's not just a pretzel company. That's the pretzel company. I was thinking of little crunchy ones. You making the big ones that's in the airport. Hell yeah, you need to tell them to put some more nuts on the one with the nuts. Yeah. Right, Antoine? <laughs> put some more nuts on there. Huh, low hat, put some more nuts on there, that'll make it delicious. <laughs> that sweet almond, that's my favorite one though. Yeah, can we work out a deal? Mm? Can we sell any ends here at the club for the white people? They love pressing. You wanna talk to the rest of the district? Yeah, do you got to talk to somebody or do they come talk to you? Okay, I appreciate that. All right, we got pretzels. Uh, starting now, we got sweet almonds, but we put hella almonds on them here. When you bite into it, we want you to feel the nuts in your mouth. <laughs> All right, um, I'm looking as far as I can see. They didn't drop the lights down, so I can't see very well. You want me to talk to him? Is that why you point at him like that? The rule is if they look away, I don't get them. So you pointed and he looked away. So I gotta leave him alone. Nice afro though. My man. That's how Meryl's hair used to look. <laughs> That's Meryl on the Murray's can. You ever seen the couple on there? That's Meryl on the right. <laughs> it's a pomade. All right, so uh, what do you do for a living, uh, great, great, 
great granny? What did you used to do? Oh my goodness. In the ICU? In Squim? Where at? Damn, you seen a lot. That's what made you move to Squim, huh? You're like, fuck this. I'm going where everybody just has splinters. Sounds very necrophiliac. She said, the best patients I had were cute, clean, and comatose. <laughs> you ain't gonna say shit. You ain't gonna say shit. You know this pussy good. Say something. <laughs> I'm killing them in here. All the air. <laughs> <laughs> On the low, that fuck around, wake him up. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Welcome back, young man. <laughs> I cut your hair while you were asleep. It's nice to meet you. Okay. All right, let's move around a little bit. How you doing, man? My brother, yes. Nice to meet you. What's your name? My name is Reggie Brown. Your full name? My name is Reggie Brown. That's a black ass name, Reggie Brown. <laughs> I bet it was a bitch getting a job with that name. As soon as they see your application, Reggie Brown. We already have our quota. <laughs> Welcome to Washington. What do you do for a living, Reggie Brown? Build apartments. Oh man, give me $300. <laughs> That's a good job, man. Hell yeah. So you build them from scratch? That's slow work though, right? You got a new building, what, about every eight years? You, you throwing them up faster than that? Reggie Brown, where's your territory that you, that you the king of? Shut up. What's, what's the, what's, where did you build that we would be like, Reggie Brown built that? Right now, probably the most recognizable one is over behind Costco. Behind Costco? The modern ones. Yeah, Reggie, you built that shit? Anybody live there? Behind Costco? He was trying to build one apartment, but you know, once you go in there, you can't just leave with one thing. He built apartments in bulk. That's dope, man. You don't meet like black builders and shit. Uh, that's not a, a thing that happens a lot. Not here. Maybe in Wakanda. <laughs> shit. You the boss too, huh? You still got on your work shoes. <laughs> Hell yeah. And so who's this with you right here? Hello? No, don't try to look away. You get together and he's still looking, so both of y'all are gonna get it. You're his wife, snatched him right up, huh? He was out there building apartments. You're like, ooh, Reggie Brown. <laughs> How long y'all been married? Five years. Oh, this is beautiful. Yeah, we all come together. Talk your shit. So y'all do it together. I like that. So building apartments is strengthening y'all unity. Okay. You ever been so behind on a project, you're like, Reggie Brown, I will leave your black ass. <laughs> <laughs> he keep right on time, don't he? Yeah, he's still wearing his work clothes, so I know he's working hard. All right, so who is this with you wearing the, uh, the fur boa? May. Like the month of May? Oh. <laughs> she said May, like the month of May. You bullshit. <laughs> May is a month? <laughs> you should switch that up. That's too easy. You should be like, my name's May. Like, I might do it. 
<laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> may. Like, I don't know if I like you enough yet. <laughs> I may do it. That. <laughs> All right. So is this one group right here? Look like everybody's kind of connected together. Does it stop before the hippies or is this all one? He was like, no, nah, we don't know these patchouli smelling motherfuckers. That's fucked up. <laughs> so the two of y'all look like y'all do something industrial too. Y'all look like y'all getting some money too, man. What do you do? That's your, bro your, your blood brother or which, which one of y'all is full blood? <laughs> He's like, neither one of us, slavery. <laughs> <laughs> I've made this a very black show for no reason. <laughs> it's because of Meryl. She the reason. I said history. It started with the, with the Rosa Parks joke, and I've just been. All right, so this is your blood brother, and y'all work every day? Do y'all do the same thing? Huh? OK. What's your title, Reggie Brown? Owner. OK, so y'all don't, you do, you, are you the same title? Owner? Uh, about to be an owner. Just oh. started. He helped me get started. With Oh shit. So you 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 spreading the knowledge and, and taking over the whole goddamn community. Damn, Reggie Brown. You build anything else? It's just as long as it's commercial, right? Man, listen, we gotta build a couple nightclubs, a couple new restaurants. We need to go Waffle House up here. That's what we Reggie Brown. No, we don't your black ass. You know what we need to do? We need to bring a Waffle House up here. That should be open two weeks. Pop, pop, nigga. <laughs> Eastside, nigga, full blood. <laughs> Shit. Waffle House is dangerous as a motherfucker. Where have you been going to Waffle House? Auburn? You don't need, we don't need to, no, no. If we gonna build some shit, let me play The Sims with Tacoma, please. We need a goddamn Papa Do's. We need two new strip clubs. We need a nice upscale nightclub where you can go and not worry about nothing, where he can't get in. No, you can't come. Your hair is fucking stupid, that's why. If you're where I'm at, I need to leave. Fuck you mean? We both doing an electric slide together, you're like, <laughs> Nah, you goddamn, you look like an arson. <laughs> what do you say? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Anyway, so you do the same thing? You do not. What do you do, sir? I'm a sanitation engineer. Sanitation engineer? Damn, you tell the dude where to go. What does that mean? You literally handle all the pipes and all the plumbing for the city? You're a garbage man. And you decide to call that a sanitation engineer? That's how much pressure you put on him, Reggie Brown. He was like, yeah, I build things in the community. I build cities. He was like, what can I say to legitimize my job? I'm a doo-doo scooper? No. <laughs> I'm a trash nigga? No. I'm a sanitation engineer. Yeah. <laughs> Can't have apartments without me, baby. And what's your name? Nice to meet you, Jason. I appreciate you for coming out. And so, is this your woman in the middle? Are you guys sitting in order? May? Like the month of May? <laughs> the temptations, my girl. And this is your wife here? Kim? Nice to meet you, Kim. I missed people, but at the same time, I feel like I got a lot of goddamn people at the same time. She don't want no smoke, man. She's looking away and shit. Asshole, you're like, get my bitch. You see, you're a dickhead. <laughs> That's why you got a baby dick, sir. <laughs> All right, my man, you good? I fucked with you off top. You was eating the whole time. Did you have fun? Yeah, of course. Oh, you actually talk like that. I thought your mouth was full. <laughs> you don't even got no more food. Yeah, of course. Absolutely. Eyebrows, we good? You done let your eyebrows out, huh? You like, you know what? This was a good time. I'm gonna tip my hat back so you can see my expressions. All right, uh, the manager, San Francisco 49er fan. You had a good time. Seahawk fan, look like you ate two of his friends. 
Pretzel Connect, we good? All right, cool. I'm sorry I didn't get you a little fucked up bangs, but I would've got them. I promise I would've got them if I had more time. I spent a lot of time uh, on the Underground Railroad right here. <laughs> I couldn't stop going down Merrill Street. <laughs> it's because she shook her titty early on. When she shook the titty, it said, say anything you want. I don't give a fuck. Do your thing, Nate. So, you know, dressed in the uh, 1998 Olympic outfit, so I had to say something. <laughs> titty doctor, we good? Yeah, outstanding. Uh, you had a good time, sir? I, 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 I. <laughs> had fun. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Did you have fun? Half blood, half blood, full blood. Y'all had a good time? <laughs> all right. Beret, you all right? I gave you a little bit of shit. Okay, cool. Uh, um, that weird place you was from. Palau, sorry. Put some respect on your shit. Husband, you good? Husband that took a shit, you all right? Cambodian with the perfect head. Cool. Uh, the, uh, the first white woman in Squim. <laughs> She's like, I got good time. And your fake grandchildren. Outstanding. And then uh, Brandy, and then uh, May, and then June. Y'all all had a good time? <laughs> all right, cool. Trash man, we good? All right. Uh, little brother that's trying to be the big brother, you had a good time? No, you trying to get your big on, you trying to, you know what I'm saying, you wanna be the boss. That shit hurt his feelings, Reggie, I don't know. It ain't on me to fix it either. You gonna have to fix your little brother. You be like, come on, man, you, you, you ain't gotta feel like that. He said, that's his life, that's what he lives, he's in my shadow. It is what it is, I'm Reggie Brown, the big brother, and he's Dudu Brown, the little brother. <laughs> All right, uh, the Italian mob boss that's black, white, and a bunch of other shit at the same time, we good? Outstanding. Oost. We good? I fuck with a lot of people tonight. This is ridiculous. Okay, the serial killer, the patchouli lady, the fucked up haircut, fireman police. Okay, wake up and comb your hair out before you come out. Thank you for your service. Look better bent over. Cartel, that's a lot of people, man. Shit. I enjoyed myself. I hope you enjoyed yourself. I'm Nate Jackson, peace.